life of a bus wannabe builder. I don't know. And musician, because we still have our equipment, some of our music equipment back there. And so we just made a trip to Lowe's and now we have some lumber, which came down a little bit in price. That's good. And then we got this bendable PVC um, trim. So we got that for the gaps where the curve is in the ceiling. So anyway, yeah. Still light in comparison. Johnny's working on the curtain for the back. Back there. Went with just a little bit lighter color. See, there's that one. And then over there is that one. So, we're just gonna use these back here. Let try it this way. Gracie. Nope. Great. Got to help a Philip head screwdriver. <laughs> Just going to show y'all what I'm doing, what I'm doing here. Uh, she's been a little uh, iffy about her curtains. She likes curtains. That's what happened to these wire curtains that we bought. I guess she'll. Uh, she sh we shared the link with you a while back. And the wire curtains, they seemed like they were working pretty good, but. I couldn't get them to tighten up all the way up. And it might just been the way I done it, but really now I don't prefer these kind of curtains. Um, when, I, when I tightened it, it, it kind of, I would tighten, I tightened it too much and the wire pulled out and the wire's poking you. I put the tape in it, you know, you see the tape. But anyway, these are not just not working out. So we're gonna get, we got rod curtains. We've already put, rods up put one on that back corner there i guess i don't know if she showed it to you or not but anyway we just i just put this one up and we got like you know just three hooks uh, three hooks so that's what we're doing Gotta pull it through this way, cause if I pull it through the other way, the wire will snag the curtain. Like I say, it might have been my fault the way I put them up, but I wouldn't recommend these curtains. These wire wire style, I don't recommend it. So we have our toilet set up, gotta do some cleanup. Put those piano hinges on there. And we got the funnel and the bucket, which we'll show you, hold on. If you lift it up, let me get it. So you've got a container that's just tall enough in the bucket. Focus, and that comes right down, I'll show you, from there. And then he put, actually I'll show you that too, he put seals to yeah. kind of seal. I'm still not finished with it, it on that right side over there by the wall. I'm gonna go ahead yeah. and close that wall that in. Yeah. Uh, in, the, in the box here, we'll box, finish boxing that some way. Yep. Kind of got ahead of myself a little bit. Yeah, not too bad. Hey guys, so we are going to move the bus. It's been a while since we've moved it. So Johnny's prepping it 
Um, we got a lot of stuff to move, as you can see. And um, anyway, he's. I gotta go prep the inside, just make sure that nothing uh, falls or anything. So anyway, we're gonna move it just so that we can keep the transmission and all that, you know, good. Right? Yeah. Having to move all my stuff that I put under the bus out. Mm-hmm, so we can, it's good to move it every so often. She's pretty, even yellow. But that's what we're gonna do very soon is paint, right? Mm -hmm. I guess I ought to be sanding the day, huh? Yep. So I gotta move some things. Um, all these, I've been putting all the screws and nails on the dash. So I'm gonna have to move all that in the trash can. And just a few things. Good that time. Yeah. And I even ran some of the lights on the inside. So I've moved some things. I've put all this stuff on the floor. Hopefully it doesn't go anywhere. We're not going, but just forward and backwards. Put all the stuff in the sink. Turned off the air conditioners. Turned off the power. So, hopefully all this stuff don't go. Hopefully not. If it does, we'll just pick it up. That's a lot of dirt. Yeah. Down the hill to here. And sits under the tires, which is not healthy for it to do. So He's a good guy. He's one of the good ones. My dad used to tell me, you're a good boy, but you stink. <laughs> that might be true right now. <laughs> Hi, Kenny. Hi, Kenny. You're gonna have to move.
Look at Melly Rocket. It Mally gonna rain. Rocket. I don't know. She said, no, I like him more. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Gotta straighten it up, it's crooked. So guys, we got the bus moved, washed out from under it best we could, and moved it back. So on this video, that's about it. We got our curtains up and what else? Finished the toilet. I, I showed a video probably of that. Yeah. yeah. And so thanks for watching all the way till the end. We appreciate you guys. Hit the thumbs up, subscribe if you have not to watch our journeys with this bus. And if you're still breathing. There's still hope. There's still hope. Don't give up. See you guys on the next one.